Hello and welcome to the TMC Newsroom. My name is Rich Tarani. Thanks for watching. We're at Interrupt 2011 on our program today is Kevin Ressler. He is the Director of Strategy and Business Development at TE Connectivity. Kevin, welcome to the show. Thank you, Rich. So tell me, uh, why is your company here at Interrupt? Your we're, first time, right? It is. Uh, we're excited. TE Connectivity is launching our Quario solution, which uh, is very, it's an excellent technology. It's going to help uh, network managers know their network really for the first time from the data center to the desktop. Okay, so um, network managers are facing a, a variety of problems and, and I was hoping that you could address some of those, those challenges. What, what are some of the things they're dealing with? Yeah, number of the common challenges, really the proliferation is just the number of devices in the network. The quantity of them, uh, the geographic locations, there's many, many locations that are part of the network now. Uh, the density of the devices becomes a challenge and the quantity is one consideration. At the same time, there's a dynamic environment of virtual resources moving across those devices in, in real time. So it makes uh, managing and controlling the network a real challenge for network managers. Now, uh, you talked a little bit about Quario. Can you, can you give us more depth on that, more detail, what it is? Yeah, absolutely. So the heart of Quario is a connection point ID technology that incorporates a sophisticated chipset into every network connector and provides a unique ID, like a Mac-like ID basically, that helps, uh, helps the Quario system uh, discover, authenticate, and build an end-to-end -end connections database across the network. So really for the physical layer, this is something new? Yeah, this is extremely important for the physical layer. It's unprecedented visibility and control of every connection point as well as every cabling pathway uh, across the network. It's extremely important. So one of the things I would imagine it can do is help with man in the middle attacks and preventing that sort of thing. Yeah, a lot of the top of mind concerns that this directly addresses are um, uh, for, for IT organizations is uh, security, uh, network availability, uh, compliance concerns, as well as operations efficiencies uh, objectives that the organizations need to meet. Uh, Corio provides vital you know, physical layer, layer one information that's really necessary in meeting these objectives. Uh, in addition, you're also able to ascertain if a wrong cable is plugged into the wrong port, right? If it's a wrong speed cable, wrong type of cable. That's a great, great example. So the types of information available on the cable is uh, uh, manufacturer information, uh, the type of the cable, whether it's shielded or unshielded. Um, there's a color code ID to it. And this helps make sure that uh, network managers and technicians are applying the right cables for the right VLANs or the different uh, separated networks that they have within their organization. So it's using the physical layer to really support the policies and practices that they're trying to achieve as an organization. And most network managers probably don't even know they can do this, right? Well, it's a, it's, it's a very new capability being introduced to Quario. So that's, uh, uh, a lot of our objective of being here at Interop uh, this week is to, is to get the word out to the network managers that now they have a rich, robust set of tools that can provide this layer one information that wasn't visible before to them and again, through our open architecture, provide this to the upstream network management systems that they're used to using to control other parts of their network today. And so total cost, um, I'm under the impression, is a few percent increase, right, over the, overall in terms of your, your uh, total cost of putting in a, or deploying cable and all of the, the uh, related equipment, routers, switches, right? Yeah, and, and the pricing is it's a, it's, it's a complicated um, uh, question has to do with, with the type of the network, the objectives that the customer is looking to do. And so it's, it's, a, real, it's, it's a system discussion that has to do with uh, the objectives that the organization is looking to meet. So it is, uh, for competitive and proprietary reasons, we don't get into uh, really discussing the pricing information, uh, but it is a unique value proposition and differentiator because of the visibility that it provides. So, so our viewers can just contact your company if yeah, they want to? Yeah, absolutely, for additional information on, now, on the solution. And you have a special website dedicated, right? If yeah, I'm not mistaken to this Rich, space? that's correct. Yeah, I would suggest uh, for additional information, please visit uh, TE Connectivity's Corio microsite at uh, knowyournetwork.com. So it's just knowyournetwork.com. That's correct. And so do you think Corio is going to have a, a major impact in the market? Yeah, TE Connectivity truly feels that this is going to have a major impact in really transforming the physical layer into a strategic asset that helps organizations meet their security, availability, compliance, and operations efficiency objectives. Excellent. Well, thanks for being on the program. It was Rich, great. thank you for your time. I appreciate great it. Great to meet you. Likewise.